Welcome to Careful Consideration of Our Common Concerns. I'm Dr. Ted Noel. I've been asked to do a short and sweet version of that mask demonstration that took 16 minutes. And so what I'm going to do first is make a very quick pass by studies. The diagrams in the bottom of this frame show two studies that demonstrate that it was air conditioning recirculating aerosols that infected large numbers of people, not droplet spread. The third study I want to look at above is from the CDC's Journal of Emerging Infectious Diseases, where they reviewed H1N1 flu, which is basically the same size as COVID-19, transmitted the same way, and they found, after looking at 14 peer-reviewed studies, that masks had no effect on the transmission of COVID-19. So without further ado, let's cut to the chase and take a look at an ordinary surgical mask, and I'm using a vape. As you can see, that vape, which has uh, aerosols the same size as COVID-19 or larger, goes through and around a surgical mask. Now, if we take a cup mask and have a good look at it, here we go. Notice it goes right through the mask easily and goes in every direction. The aerosol is not affected by the mask in any material. Now we look at a surgical mask with a foam strip to protect above and keep my glasses from fogging. Lo and behold, the aerosols go all around it. It has no effect on me spreading aerosols to you. Now a cloth mask I borrowed from my wife. Once again, here we go. Boom, straight through and around. It has no effect on the spread of aerosols. They go everywhere. And then I went and bought a guard mask with a high efficiency filter material. That one, here we go. Watch for it. Through and around. It had no effect on the vape aerosol, which remember is the same size or larger. Now, I don't have an N95 mask. I have these shop respirators where they can put all kinds of things in them, but they're like an N95 because when you breathe out, everything goes out through a valve. Guess what? It might protect me from you. It sure isn't going to protect you from me. Let's look at that again. Boom. Any mask with a button on it has a valve that lets everything go from you to your neighbor. It has no effect on anything. I think you can get the picture now. There is absolutely nothing that any of these masks do to protect you from me. And the fact is that. Unless I have a mask which is fully sealed and where I breathe through the filter material both directions and I have a really high quality filter, nothing is going to protect in either direction. Because just the same way that the vape went out, around, and through, it will come in around and through. Aerosols will not be stopped by mass. You don't need a big study. All you need is this. Because the aerosol here is actually larger in molecular size than the aerosol from your breath. And because your breath has a smaller, tighter aerosol, just because it can't be seen ordinarily, that aerosol will go everywhere. It gets through easier. It gets around easier. Mask. Guard masks. Cloth masks. What are they good for? Oh. Here's what they're good for. If I'm going to cough, they make it so I don't have to do this <coughs> and catch the aerosol or, or, or pull out a handkerchief and do it. They don't work. Remember, 
I am a doctor. I do not play one on TV. Until next time, take a look at those links below. Join me on MeWe or on Parlay, the new non-censoring, non-tracking versions of Facebook and Twitter. But if you must use the old left-wing censoring versions, we're still on Facebook and at VidZet on Twitter. The message is what matters. I'm Dr. Ted Noel. Thanks for watching.